Hello my lovely Taurus, welcome back to my channel, you're watching Vita Mind and I'm your friend Nahi from Korea. Today I'd like to give you some affirmation first of all and let me move on to the love and romance reading. Okay, oh it's so hot. Such a wonderful hot sunny Monday here in Korea. How's the weather? There. I really hope you're having a wonderful day wherever you are. So Taurus, the first message is hope. Okay, let me read this one for you. Hope indicates that the sun is about to come out in an area of your life. The angel wisdom reminds you that your spirit is immensely resilient and powerful, so keep faith with your dreams and visions. Remember the universe wants you to have your heart's desire. It is simply waiting for you to believe you deserve it before, you, before the angels bring it to you. Do your part by deciding what you truly want, then send out, send out positive thoughts for the changes you seek and for the fulfillment of your wishes. Ask the angels for help and they will fan the sparks of potential and bring them to life. Hope is a magnetic quality which attracts the great and beautiful into your life. So Taurus, this week's affirmation is, as you can see at the bottom of the, at the, bottom of the card, I am eternally optimistic. Comment down below this week's affirmation, I'm eternally optimistic. How beautiful. I'm eternally optimistic optimistic so yeah no matter what comes to you this week remember that there is no such thing which is impossible for you at least this week okay wow don't forget that without a hope human history and your history cannot be made okay stick with your hope i dare say that my lovely taurus I'm eternally optimistic. That's a wonderful message. Okay, so let me ask the angel. What else? The energy for the Taurus, for my lovely Taurus soul families. What's the message for my lovely Taurus? The bottom of the deck. Be honest with yourself, Taurus. Be honest with yourself. Look into your heart. Look into your heart. Look into your heart and you will know the truth of this situation. It is, it is safe to admit the truth to yourself. So we will support and guide you through any necessary changes. Lean upon us for courage and the strength to take good care of yourself. Focus only upon your true desires and they will come to you upon angels' wisdom, angels' wings. Okay, so Taurus, the angel and spirit guide and universe literally asking you what you truly want. What do you want? What do you want to do? What do you want to achieve? What do you want to pursue in your life, Taurus? It's not about your family members' desires. It's not about your girlfriend, boyfriend, husband, wife's desires. It's all about your desire, okay? Be honest with yourself, my lovely Taurus. It's your life. It's your choice, okay? So focus on your dream and remember that you are optimistic this week. So you can achieve anything you want once you put your mind and energy into doing it, into pursuing it, okay? So thank you, Angel. Lastly, for the general energy, general energy for my lovely Taurus, let me ask the angel. Ask for help from others. Of course, we can ask, you can ask for help from your loved ones and also from the spirit guide and angels. Whatever you are, whatever you want, you can manifest also by yourself. But if there is any supporting system around you, take full advantage of them. Okay? Yes, there are people, there are kind-minded people who would like to give you helping hands. If you look carefully, who would like to do that, okay? Okay, one more from the end of answer. What's the energy for my lovely Taurus? There's something better, okay? There is something better. So, Taurus, if you think that you have been putting a lot of energy and effort in pursuing a certain dream and goal, you have been working through, walking toward a certain dream, and uh, you think that, now it's time for you to get the reward. Now it's time to you see the beautiful results, result outcome, but there's nothing coming out of the situation. And then it's okay for you to detour to another life path. Okay, you know what I'm saying? So yes, that's the angel message. There might be something better or there might be someone better if you are dealing with some karmic situation or karmic relationship partners. Maybe they are meant to be your special person. They are meant to be in your life. Well, they are meant to be in your life to give you the life lesson. But, you know, if you are still dealing with energetically speaking and physically, if you're still dealing with uh, karmic relationship partners, karmic ex-partners, they give you a lot of uh, exhausting moment. So your energy level will be down. So instead of being near them, it's time to say goodbye and look for another true romantic partner in your life there might be something better there might be someone better so that's the end of the message okay so now let me move on to the love and romance reading what's the energy for my lovely taurus okay there are four cards 
Okay, first of all, you have unrequited love, unrequited love towards. There is not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. So I just told you that you may be some of my lovely towers. You may be still dealing with the the karmic relationship partner, karmic partners, even though there is no love, not enough love and attraction or not enough hope left. There is your love between you guys. The love has been all that, all gone long before, but you are still dealing with, you're energetically speaking, you're still dealing with your partner. Yeah. Okay. But there is this one. Healing family issues. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. So maybe, Taurus, you have been from a sad childhood memories from, I mean, you are maybe, you may have some sad memories from the childhood. Maybe your parents divorced a long time ago when you were a little kid. And maybe you were uh, parented, where you were raised by single mom or single daddy. So your true idealistic concept of partner or partnership or true love may have been damaged, you know what I'm saying, because of the childhood memories. So instead of focusing on the negative memories from the childhood, it's time for you to forgive your parents and try to understand them because they are also they are your parents, but before they become your parents, they are also a woman and a man, right? They are just human being. So it's not it's not their fault to make the mistake, relationship problems, I mean your parents. And also it's not your fault to be their child, you know what I'm saying? So you try to forgive and forget whatever happened in the past, your childhood memories, your single parents, single mother, try to understand them, okay? Maybe because of the uh, distorted image of love, you can't fully commit to someone else, even though, I mean, you can, even though you love somebody, you can't fully focus on loving themselves, or you can't fully focus on loving yourself, you know what I'm saying? So it's, it's time for you to move forward, saying goodbye to the negative energy from the childhood memories, because, because, Taurus, at the end of the day, you will end up with a beautiful, beautiful person, okay, who is from the child, who is from the past life, okay? So maybe you are, you know who I'm talking about, you may have met them, and you are still de dealing with them, energetically speaking, Taurus, you have known each other before and you are dealing with someone who has that magnetic attraction not just physical level but emotional attachment or emotional connection and soulful level you click each other right so you want to build some romantic castle with them but for some reason maybe because of the child childhood issues traumatic event still lingering on your heart you can't truly commit to your uh, special person yes it, it can happen yeah so, yeah, that's the advice from your angel. It's time to heal yourself and heal the family issues, whatever the family issue is to you, okay? And the fourth card is honeymoon. Oh, my gosh. So, Taurus, enjoy the bliss of holiday time together. So, with the special person who might be your past life lover, past life couple, past life husband, well, girlfriend, boyfriend, or wife, you will uh, have a wonderful time together with them. Okay, and the bottom of the day, I'd like to see... Keep an open mind, okay? Your true soulmate may be different from your usual type and expectations, okay? So if you have never met your special person yet, where is it, the, the past life lover? If you don't think that you have met them yet, be open-minded. Maybe this week somebody will approach you online or offline and they might be different from your, your usual type of expectations or usual type of lovers, so be open-minded. And the bottom of the deck is new love. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. Okay, so Taurus, for some of my lovely Taurus, you have met someone recently, and the special person, new love, might be your past life relationship. So that's why you're drawn to them without explanation. You don't know why you're drawn to them, right? So that's what we call 전생 in Korean, 전생의 인연. That, that is the past life relationship. So, yeah. So, wow, you're going to have a new love. I'd like to see what's going on with you. Okay, these text messages that your special person want to send to you, maybe new person or maybe your past person want to say, hi, uh, how have you been doing? They want to reconcile with you. So Taurus, let's see what's going to be your special person's text messages. What's going to be their hidden feeling for you? Okay, all right, let me sip some coffee and read. P.S. I love you. Your special person, have they confessed their love yet? If not, 
remember that because of ego, they can't fully express themselves, but deep down in their heart, they love you. Believe in yourself, Taurus. Your special person will encourage you and remind you how powerful, how beautiful you are, okay? Believe in yourself, Taurus. You can achieve anything you want. That's the same message from the angel, and that's the same message from your special person. So this week, believe in yourself. Follow your heart, my lovely Taurus. They want to say that to you. The special person in your heart already knows that you love them. They feel the love from you. But for some reason, my lovely Taurus, you have never expressed fully how you feel, how you truly feel about them, right? So they are asking you, Taurus, follow your heart. I know that you love me. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. Say I love you. That's how they feel about you. Money is the only thing holding me back. Okay, so this energy can be reversed. Maybe this is your energy, right? So maybe because of money issue, your special person or you cannot fully express the love toward each other. Don't settle for less, okay? Don't settle for less. Yeah, the text messages, I mean, I mean the hidden messages, hidden feelings is that they know that they love you and they know that you love them. So even though the outer interference, like uh, such as money issues, financial issues or success, sometimes hinders you from uh, pursuing each other, don't settle for less. Let's find the true love because they love you. I'm not going anywhere. Yeah, your special person is not trying to run away so don't worry they will be there and they know that you you may need your time so they will be patient mm -hmm. they're not going anywhere so beautiful you're amazing yeah they think so highly of you my lovely Taurus you're amazing let that hurt go yes and your special person knows that you are dealing with some karmic relationship partner relationship karmic ex-partners or they know that they feel that Telephatically speaking, they know that you have been through a lot of things from the childhood and they want you to let that hurt go. Oh my gosh, so beautiful. We clearly were in love. Yes, this is a past verb. So maybe currently you guys are not talking to each other even though you love each other or in the past you were got, you were so passionately in love, crazily in love because for some reason at the moment you are not that hot each other, right? So, yeah, they have their reminiscing uh, memories. They really miss the moment. And, yeah, so lovely. I will protect you. Whatever comes to you, they want to be your supporting system. One last. I'm never letting you go. Okay, the, the text message is very consistent. The feeling toward you is very consistent. They love you. They want to protect you. They are not going to go anywhere. They are not going to let you go. Okay, so your person really loves you and they will be there for you then they will give you the time you need okay that's the message from your special person i really hope this message helps you in navigating your love life and uh, you know life also okay i'll be back next time until then have a wonderful week i love you taurus bye take care Come, namaste bye i love you